Hello and welcome to this new video. So a few months ago, my family just moved to North France in Normandy. Uh, I don't know the area, so I've decided to take a day to visit it and show you around, show you all these beautiful places that you can find around here. I also just received my new drone for Christmas, so I'm going to try that out. There is some wind, so I don't know if it's going to be very successful, but I need to try it out. So I think it was quite a success. Uh, the wind wasn't so bad. Uh, the footage looks really nice. And right now I'm going to the lighthouse and then I'll go back to the car and I'll tell you where we're gonna go today. So this was the first uh, location and then we'll go to two other places and three if I have time. Okay, so this was the lighthouse, now let's go back to the car and see where we are going next. So I wanted to show you on the map where we've been and where we're going, so... Right now we're somewhere around here, Cap Levy, with the fort that we've just seen, the Four Levy. Um, then I think we're gonna drive to uh, Jobor, it's called the Nose of Jobor. It's on the other side. The Nose of Jobor. Oh, well, the focus is horrible. And then go down the coast and go to Vauville, which is right here. And then, uh, if I have time, there is one place I really want to go, which is totally on the other side, which is the bay, some bay, I forgot the name. Anyway, so if I have time I go here, but yeah, this is basically the map of the north of Normandy. And so we'll basically we'll go mostly in the north, and if I have time we'll go in the south. But for now, we're going to Jobourg. So I am right now at Jobour, the nose of Jobour. Uh, we're gonna have a look, walk around and see this beautiful landscape. And the light is really nice. There's not so much wind like usual. So this place is really similar to the Cliff of Moor in Ireland and up this way. Right now, it's really, really amazing. Maybe I can take a drone shot from here. Wow, that's beautiful. That's beautiful. Second flight very successful, I lost it at one point but it came back home. It's pretty good actually for a very small thing. I'm gonna do some other shots of this place and then we'll go to the next uh, location for uh, a really nice sunset. I hope we'll be there before the sun goes down.
Man, I didn't know that traveling and filming was taking so much time. I'm running everywhere. So I'm not back on the car. Um, so we're going to go to this place called Beauville, which is quite close to here. So I won't film the way to get there because I don't have enough time. And I don't even have time to go to the place I wanted to go down to the south. So see you there. Welcome to Verville. So this is quite beautiful. I'm gonna try some drone shots. The, um, this area of France is very famous for this really long beach and really flat. And there is literally no one on the beach, so it's quite amazing. Okay, let's try the drone. So the drone is flying back home. There is a bit too much wind. And I think it's enough for today. I have really good images. I'm really happy with it. It's coming back. Let's walk a bit on the beach. The light is beautiful. So if you visit France one day, you should really pass by Normandy. It's a very authentic um, area of France. It's very familial and you can really see what's France. And you find beautiful beaches like this with no one. So much wind. So I really hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, the thing is, I'm editing my video from Ethiopia was taking a lot of time because it's a big video and I'm working with a company on it so I need their approval after I edit it so it will take some time and because I just arrived in this region I really wanted to visit it so it was the opportunity uh, I just got the drone at Christmas so I'm quite impressed of uh, the footage I can get so I'm really happy with that my next video will be probably about Ethiopia and then I have a really cool project coming up so stay tuned bye